What's up, Dragon? It's Ray Mason here, and today I'm telling you guys a really good story, one I forgot to tell you guys about. So today I'm telling you guys a story how I met a famous singer at school. Yes, I am not lying. This is not clickbait. I actually met, met him, it's like, a long time ago, a few years ago, I don't know. No? So let's get into it. So today's story takes place, uh, long, few, few years ago, a year ago. Uh, it's like any other day. I wake up, get dressed, dress. I uh, watch some YouTube. Mom takes me, takes me to school. I get into school, hang out with my friends, eat some breakfast. Then you know, school starts, and I do some school, school work, yada yada yada. And then in one of my classes, I was doing my usual school work, and I walk out. I asked my teacher if I walk out, she's the more there left, and she just said of course, and I walked out, out, and I turned to my right and I see this guy walking in and be like, okay, he must have been a teacher, must be a, must be someone's dad coming, I mean, and then, I don't know, no, so I look, I come into my, go into my locker, grab something I need, need, oof, and I come into my class and I see the same guy again. I'd be like, okay, someone's dad must be here. Like, someone must be in trouble. Like, whose dad be? Um, turns out I was wrong. Uh, apparently, my counselor knew this guy. And apparently, from what my mom told me, that they were friends. Friends? And apparently, this guy was an actual famous singer. Holy smokes. I can't believe it. So, uh, my friend, my friend, I'm not going to sing. Name, I'm gonna call him my friend I was with. Let's call him David. David is a really good friend of me. We've been friends for like since junior high. We haven't been friends since freshman and senior when we were like enemies, but once we had junior, we literally became friends. Friends like bros. So David and I see this guy, and we realized he was a singer, and my friend David starts freaking out. He's a really good freaking out. He was shaking. I made sure. That David doesn't like ask how or anything from his excitement. He's a really good famous sing singer, and um, uh, my teachers were talking to him, and I went up to him, I shake his hand, I spoke to him, and he's a really cool dude, dude, really nice guy, and um, yeah, my teachers were talking to him. Uh, Pull up a video about with him in it, and he actually explained to us how he does it. it. Was like something where the pandemic was happening. Don't know how, or why, but yeah, he was a really good singer. David got an autograph with him, which is awesome. And I got talk, kept talking to him, which was awesome. Talked to him, really cool dude. And then the rest of the day, school start. Rest school. The rest of school ended, and my mom came, she picked me up, and she drove me back home, and I pretty much told her that I met the famous singer, and she was jealous that every time, every time I see my parents watch, see one of these guys' videos, they were just jealous because their son, me, was met, met him, like, do you pretty much blame, blame me for meeting the guy singer? Like, he literally, no joke, came into my school. school. Like, what chances can that be? But yeah, I told my parents about, about that. They were jealous, but they were also excited that I, that I met the famous singer. Because I don't watch, watch this guy's stuff. All I do know is that he's a really good singer. But yeah. Uh, that's pretty much where I ended. Hope you guys enjoyed this story time. Leave a like if you do. And, uh, there's only two more days to my birthday. So, make sure you guys go turn on notifications. So you guys know. And also, go watch my friend. Go to Mel Rhino's channel. Because he's actually going to be uploading, making a video on my birthday. So, go to his channel. Subscribe. Turn on notifications. So you'll never know when you post a new video. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this story time. Ray Mason, signing out. See you, dragons.